What's going on everyone? Your boy Kevin back again. Today I'm going to be talking about a 5G uh, light bulb security cam that I did a review uh, about a month ago. I'm going to tell you guys the bad things about this. Be aware. Watch this video till the end. Please be aware of this thing. So first let me show you guys the unboxing of this and what does it come with and uh, some of the stuff that you guys need to know about it. You get a manual book, you get this, and screws. Very nice, very light, it's not heavy at all. This thing rotates all around up to here and this way, and this thing goes all around almost. So it goes like this, stops here, goes like this, stop here, and this thing goes everywhere. So you can watch your whole house or outside, you can watch everywhere. Very cool, these are all the lights are on there, so as soon as you walk by the sensor, the lights, boom, flash on. This is 5G. This thing is very easy to use. Just plug it in, screw it, and uh, connect it to Wi-Fi. Uh, download the app and you're ready to go. So to set up this first, uh, very easy. You have to download this app right here. Once you download this app there, make sure you um, uh, make your own uh, account there. As soon as that's done, you screw this into the wall. Then you go to your Wi-Fi, you're going to look for this. Once you find this in your Wi-Fi, you connect, then you press your password, then that's uh, connected to the Wi-Fi. Once you do that, you go back to the app, you open it, you can record, you can listen, you can uh, control this up and down. I'm going to show you guys how does it work in the app. Once you open the app, there's your recording, there's your voice, there's the instructions how to use it. You can set it up the way that you like it. You can press the two dots in the corner to make it to a full screen. And if you want to go left, you press the circle to the left. And if you want to go down, you press it down. If you want to go up, you press up. And you can see how clear the image is. It's in HD. I'm going to wave my hand right now and the sensor is going to go on. Now I'm going to show you guys a little bit how it looks if somebody's walking into the room. If you can see it's very clear, you can press record like what I'm doing right now. The record button is on and I'm going to show you guys how the video looks after. So yeah, very easy app to use. Anybody can use it and you can use it anywhere in the world you want. Now I'm going to show you guys a video that I took with this thing and some pictures. So we got that out of the way. Now I'm going to be talking about this thing. So where I hooked this up, I hooked it up outside where my hallway is to go to my back door to the uh, to the backyard. And I have cameras all over my house. Those are the cameras that I check every day on my phone. I'm always looking at it, see what my dogs are doing. It's just you know look around the house, see what's going what's going on. This one I never look at it. And when I set this thing up. Obviously you don't need a subscription, it's up to you if you want to buy it. You can just put a, a memory card here and just store everything to the memory card. So I want to open the app, I just decided that I wanted to open the app the other day. I all tried to open it, I'm like, what, I can't get in there. It says Yo, there's no Wi-Fi connections. So I'm like, okay, I keep trying, trying, I couldn't get in there. So I came home and I want to open the app, it still telling me the same thing. So if you can see, it keeps telling me it's offline. And I keep trying, 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 keeps coming offline, offline, offline. Even if I press it, keeps telling me, check out your uh, internet connection. And I keep doing that, nothing, nothing, nothing. I go to uh, settings, keeps telling me the same thing. 
So I deleted the account, I hooked it up again, deleted, hooked it up, back and forth, see what's wrong with this thing, then I couldn't get in there. So, then there was a bill at the bottom, I pressed the bill, so pretty much for this, they only give you like four to five days to use it, they're very, very tricky. After that, they cut off your Wi-Fi, the only way that you can use this is to buy a subscription from them. And to buy a subscription, it gets pretty expensive. Let's go through the, some of the accounts of the subscription. So we're gonna go to shopping. It's gonna bring us to this page. So you can buy seven days, one month, 30 days, 12 months. And it gets really expensive. So you see that. Then be aware, some people don't read it. I think 99% of people that buy subscriptions, they just press okay, done, they do not read the say in the contract. You need to read the contract. Let me show you guys the contract on this thing. Let's get in there. So they make it really long to read. That's why people don't read it. If you read that, then you know what I'm talking about. They pretty much they tell you that they can save your data. Yes, they can save your data. It's too much to read. I know some of you guys don't even want to read that. So I went step by step in the contract. They say to hook this up, you need a subscription and they're allowed to keep your data. Be aware of this. So when I say they're allowed, they're allowed to keep your data. You know what that means? Whatever is going around your house, if they think they need to keep your data stored, they will keep your data. So do not hook this up in your uh, living room or in the bedroom. Those are the two things I'm, I'm uh, telling you guys, please do not do that. And what I did, I uh, just wanted to see if this thing works. I bought description and I deleted it right away right after. I wanted to see if this thing works. Yes, it did work after that. But then the motor on this thing, I didn't even use it at all. The motor does not churn, doesn't go back and forth. It's already broken. So that's what I wanted to warn people about this thing. Please, there's other things that you can buy, better security cams. Let pay a little bit more money and try to buy something that's secure has security in it. You know, not something like this that we don't even know where the data is going. So I'm gonna leave it like that. Please let me know in the comments and uh, let me know what you guys think. And you guys have the same problem or not? I'm gonna catch you guys in my next video. Peace out for now.